Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2, uh, Tropical Fun. Now, uh, I've been looking around the map uh, since last time we got basically everything connected up with passengers, so uh, that gives us uh, something of a, uh, of a, um, a whatchamacallit, a uh, income base. Uh, you know, we'll take a look here. Uh, we have a 1.5 million loan. Uh, we're in 1911. Uh, that means we have 30 million max loan available. Uh, we're earning, uh, you know, seven, eight million per um, per half year. So uh, we've actually got the uh, income basis um, to uh, do some uh, uh, some more uh, work. Uh, so yeah, okay. So we're up to um, you know. 10 million uh this particular uh term so um yeah uh that means uh, uh we have a pretty good uh income base to work on new projects now i wasn't sure what i was going to do uh when i uh, started up the game today uh but you know what i started looking around and I see we've got this big stack of uh, oil wells over here. And there's a couple of oil refineries at this end of the map as well. And it occurred to me that uh, I can actually connect uh, uh, some of them up to the oil refineries and then, uh, then do some uh, additional uh, operations with that. Now, uh, and then when I got looking here, I realized that I've also got a, a Comats plant over here. Uh, so ultimately, I'll need to bring stone in uh, uh, from somewhere. Uh, don't know where, uh, because we don't have any over here. Uh, not over here. Nope. Uh, not over here. Nope. Uh, nothing over here. Uh, we don't have uh, stone over here or down here or even off over here in the water. So uh, we've got uh, a surplus of oil wells though, uh, and a surplus of uh, forests. So I might uh, end up uh, uh, bringing up the sandbox uh, mod and adding uh, a few strategic industries. Because I mean, we've got uh, a stone quarry over here. Uh, but we don't have much of that, right? Uh, so, uh, you know, the, the possibility of basically connecting everything up. So we got three stone quarries on the map so far. Now what we can do, um, that's town industry statistics. Uh, if we sort by product, we can see if we uh, make this bigger, uh, come on here. Um, so we've got only four stone quarries on the entire map. Um, now, uh, stone quarries, but we've only, but we've got four conmats plants as well. So, you know, uh, maybe, uh, just maybe we can kind of make that work. Uh, and it occurred to me, you know, the way the, um, the map is um, is set up like we've got this huge stack of of uh, oil wells one two three four five six seven eight. 15 of them and we've got one two three four five six seven uh, seven oil refineries now uh, you need two uh, two oil wells to max out an oil refinery. So we've got one, one too many uh, oil refineries, but uh, we've only got um, requirements. Um, oil, we want oil, one, two, three, four, five, six, but we only have six uh, consumers for uh, refined oil and uh, so on, right? And just the way everything's laid out on the map, it occurred to me that maybe, just maybe, uh, it might make some sense to do a little bit of a, uh, you know, mainline type uh, hub 
hub system uh, you know where I uh, I set up uh, hubs at strategic locations like say at Garland and then I connect up the uh, local industries to it and then uh, say over here again at uh, what is that called uh, Arvada uh, connect these up uh, you know uh, over here another one at Berkeley uh, you know that sort of thing uh, and then I can uh, set up uh, you know a, a stack of uh, of industry uh, going and then everything has the chance of uh, sending stuff where it can be used now that has some potential issues it'll likely lead to substantial game lag and it'll work best in some cases with trucks and uh, the trucks that'll work best for that come later you know in the 1950s and 60s you know uh, much later than we're at right now still we've got some stuff where connecting by rail makes sense and like here uh, and I think I would put the uh, cargo hub uh, over here for Garland and that would uh, that would mean uh, we'd be we could be in range of this oil refinery uh, and uh, yeah and I think that's what I'm gonna do I'm going to bring this oil refinery online and then that's going to serve as a uh, hub. So let's uh, get rid of that uh, extraneous, um, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, road. That's, that's, a, that, that's what you call it, right? It's a road. Uh, and I'll put a uh, cargo station up here uh, so that uh, this is, it's in catchment here. And uh, right, so let's start out with that. And we're up to 12 million in the bank, so now that's not going to be a problem to pay for this. Now, if since this is going to be some sort of a hub, uh, well, it's going to be a through station. Um, we'll make it 320. Uh, no, no, we don't want uh, catenary. Uh, now, I'm going to, I'm going to put it. I can't, can't, oh, I can put, ooh. I can put it here and get tendril action. Okay, so I'm going to put it there. Right, okay. Now, uh, I'm going to need to run a rail line over this water here. Now, uh, that's going to be my uh, first main project here. Uh, so, uh, the first step is to get the bridge in. And then I'm going to have to bridge over here and then come in over here. Now, what am I going to need here? I'm going to need one train coming for the, uh, uh, one line coming for the uh, oil well, which is tanks. And this is going to be flat car. Um, I'm going to need two lines for this because it's going to be um, uh, gondolas for the stone inbound and flat cars, I think, for the conmats outbound. So we're going to need. Uh, and then I'm going to need one more. Um, I'm going to need one more inbound train here. And uh, so I'm going to need four platforms here at least. So I'm, I'm going to add those. Um, right. Uh, well, I'm going to need several platforms at least anyway. Um, yeah, because we don't use con mats here. Uh, but I might take directly from here to someone that does. Um, I don't see who that is. Uh, not Thornton. Uh, well, we got, yeah, Arvada uses it. So, yeah. Uh, so I'm going to end up with a freight line across here. Uh, so I think there will have to be a hub at Killeen as well. Okay, so I'll run the freight line up along here. Uh, set up a hub somewhere over here. And a hub over here. Yeah. 
Okay. Yeah, so I'm definitely going to need to do that. Um, right, I was up here. Uh, okay, so now we need more tracks. Uh, right. Now we can potentially get away with uh, smaller trains and duplicate and uh, doubling up these platforms by extending this one and uh, making a gap in the middle, right? Uh, but uh, I'm going to start out. Oh, man. Uh, right. Uh, good. Okay, so we've got a, a four-track station here. Now, um, right. So I need to get over, I think over. Can we just get over here? Oh, that would be perfect. Uh, okay, so let's call up tracks and see what happens if we just do this. Uh, no. Yeah, that's not going to work coming in that direction. Um, no, this is going to have to be level. Uh, at least... No, that doesn't quite work. So we're going to have to... One, two, three. Is that enough? Oh, it is. Okay. But we're getting... Oh, if we go... Oh, that, that'll that work. Good. I can get across. Um, yeah. I can get across there. Good. Um, right. Okay. Well, we'll do that. Yeah, we'll do that. Now, we need to... Oh, we can actually... It actually connects. Good. Now, do I want to viaduct that or... Eh, I'll embank it. It'll be an embankment. Okay, uh, so I'm going to need at least two tracks around this way, so we'll do that. Good. Now, uh, I need to get across here, but I need to get to it first. Uh, you know what? I can get rid of that road. Yeah, I can get rid of the road, because I won't need it, because I'll be using rail. That solves a collision problem. Okay, yeah, we're good. Right, now, uh, from here, uh, we grab this, and... Right, if I keep going level here, I get a viaduct, which I think I, I think I'm okay with. Uh, but we'll use this this bridge. Okay, so yeah, that's kind of the direction I want to go there. Uh, the stone viaduct would be the same speed, but, uh, basically, but that's fine. Um, right, and now we'll go across here. Bridge pillar collision with what? With what? Now it's not. Oh, it was... Oh, that's neat. Uh, yeah, we'll take that. Uh, yeah, okay. So doing that. Um, okay, now. Uh, what happens if we come around to here? 
we are uh, potentially up way too high. You know what? I'm going to take that. Uh, I can afford it, and it, uh, it means I'll have a higher um, bridge over the water here. Okay, so we come across the water uh, level, and yeah, okay, that should be fine. Um, right. Across. Good. Now, uh, now what I need to do is uh, take that off because now we can come back down. Yeah. And, well, that looks ugly, but you know what? I think that's fine. So, come on. What? It crashed. Well, that's fun. Right, okay. Uh, we're back after the uh, crash to desktop there. Um, so, let's, um, let's build the... Uh, bridge here again so we come across uh, straight um, want to go level across there and level across here now um, want to come down to ground level ish uh, say to about there. Now, if we do this, um, yeah, not so much. Let's keep the, uh, the viaduct thing going. Uh, now let's see, this is what crashed last time. And I think it's because it tried to make an embankment in the water. Now, uh, okay. We're, uh, we should be okay now, so I'm going to need to uh, peel off going this way for the, um, oh wow, uh, for the uh, oil well. I should uh, build the, uh, the platform there. I only need the one platform but we'll make it long um, because who doesn't like uh, having some long freight trains uh, running in their uh, in their uh, uh, no, ah, wrong wrong station type uh, right we want that one uh, right Okay, we got tendril action there. We're good. Uh, now, uh, tracks. You can come across here. Yeah, that's okay. And you can come across there. Right. Um, good. That connects up. Now, I need a two platform station here. Uh, maybe I want to put it on this side. Yeah, I think I do. That's a little further from the main track. Uh, kind of like that, I think. Now, does that... Yeah, that gets it. Uh, okay, so I think I'm going to need to back the bridge up a bit here say to there you know what i'm going to save it before i try messing around there again yeah okay now uh tracks uh, you connect up to there like that go 
you connect up to there like that. Good. Now, uh, from here, I need to... Oh, come on. Well, I'm going to do it this way. Uh, yeah, that is a bit um, tight, but uh, right now is that? Yeah, okay. That's that one. So we'll do this. Right. And then we'll do this. Now, is that okay? Oh, for pity's sake, it's got catenary. Turn off catenary. Right. Now, uh, we come along here. I think that gives us a long enough run up that the long trains will fit. So we'll do a uh, crossover here. Uh, oh, good. It's nice that uh, Transport Fever 2 lets these things work on corners. They just didn't on uh, it back in Transport Fever 1. Now, we're going to go over to uh, here. And we'll uh, upgrade this not to have... Uh, catenary because it's pointless uh, okay yeah it's definitely pointless uh, because we're not going to run electric trains on here uh, right okay so yeah yeah we're not going to run electric trains on here so uh, having the catenary uh, just uh, leads to uh, lower frame rates and everything. Uh, so, you know, let's uh, not do it. Uh, okay. Okay, problem solved. Now, uh, okay, so that gets us up to here uh, with those. Um, now we need another, hmm, do I want to just go with 160 platforms? Uh, and I can double the platforms up on these if I do it that way and still have, you know, you know what? Hmm. If I do that, then I end up with more shorter trains, but uh, a smaller footprint on the hub stations. Uh, and then I can use uh, one set of long platforms for inter-hub transport and smaller trains to link to the... Um, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm... I think I'm, I'm going to do that. Okay. Uh, so configure uh, bulldozer. Uh, these are 320s. So uh, that makes it 240. Wait, did I uh, shrink that too far? Um, one, two, three, four, yeah, no, those are 160s, okay, uh, right, uh, well, in that case, I can take this business out, right, and I can make this a little less aggressive, right, so then we can do this, yeah, yeah, this is what I'm going to do, uh, okay, and I still need a crossover like that. Okay, uh, so that's uh, definitely what we're going to do. Uh, okay, so I cut this one down as well. Uh, bulldoze, 
One, two, three, four. Okay. And yeah, let's just do that. Okay. Yeah, this is what I'm going to do for sure. Now, uh, this here is Garland Oil Well number two. And because I'm having a CDO uh, spell, I'm going to correct that. And we're going to make this Garland Oil Well number two. Yep. And uh, this is going to be uh, Garland Construction Materials Plant. Yep. And this is going to be Garland Construction Materials Plant. Yep. Okay. Now, and this here is going to be um, Garland Freight Hub slash oil refinery. Okay. Uh, right. So uh, the, this is 320. I want to have a break of two 160 platforms. So I'm going to take this out. I'm no. I'm going to configure this and I'm going to add one more uh, length of platform over here. And then I'm going to one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to take out like this. Um, yeah. And then I can put regular track here. Now, what this does, if we look at terminals, we now have double the number of terminals. Now, I've done this in other games, and it actually works quite well. Um, so then I can use these half platforms for local connections. Um, and then I can uh, make full length platforms, which might be around this platform, which will be for interhub. But I need um, I need uh, platform for for the iron mine, uh, the oil well. Um, these uh, will probably connect up over here. So I need one, two, I need two, I need three platforms from this side, two platforms from this side, and then whatever through connecting platforms. So yeah, okay, uh, this should work. Now, uh, this can come over here. Uh, no, I'm gonna have to back that up or it's just gonna look stupid. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we can do it that way. Um, right. So we're going to have the oil will come in on, say, this platform. The... Right. So I'm going to need one more track. One more platform linked up over here. Okay, so we'll do this. Okay, like that. Then we'll do this. Yep. So that means we can come in this way. Uh, and then if I put a track here. Yeah, that will get me all of the platform movements I need on that one. Uh, okay, so let's put a signal or two on here. So we'll need a signal there. We'll definitely need a signal here and one here. 
and one here yeah and one here and we'll definitely need one way over here good now I think I probably need to break these blocks up a bit right like that and maybe like that I probably shouldn't do this in the orbital bombardment view but right um, it's kind of nice that you can put signals arbitrarily on bridges uh, that is really nice this is probably way more signals than I actually need but it uh, it will at least allow me to put a stack of trains through there so I'm going to need I think at least two going to the oil well and I'm going to need probably probably three or four going to the conmats plant so uh, but there's no point running the trains for the conmats until I have the um, have stone connected to this network so I won't now uh, I need to also get out around here uh, to this to this oil well the oil refinery will use the production of two complete oil wells so I'll uh, definitely uh, whoops need to do that uh, I need a single platform at this oil well okay and it's going to be 160 and we'll put it back here just like that and then I need to get over this passenger line with it as well so if I come out here I do like that I end up oh I think I can in fact get over that well in that case cancel that okay so I need to um, now if I do this level I'm not going to get over uh, no, not so much, but if I go up like that, yeah, I think that should be enough. So if I go here, I think I can drop this a couple of ticks. Now, no. Now, does this go over? No, it doesn't. I could not drop it a couple of ticks. Okay, well we'll try that again uh, right so uh, we'll come out straight we'll go up a tick here now I think this will be enough I think it's not Okay, so we're going to have to go maximum up bubble here. Uh, right. Uh, no, you want rail, you moron. Uh, okay, so we'll come out of here. We'll go... Uh, that's maximum up bubble, I think. Now, we'll see. Yeah, that will allow us to make a bridge good now hmm uh, I don't think there's any point quibbling over the speed of the bridge and the stone one looks nicer so here we go just like that um, Hmm, that might be okay. 
uh, right. Then uh, we come uh, here, right. Uh, turn that off. Yeah. If we do that, eh. yeah, we'll keep the viaduct. Yeah. Good. Now, we just need to wang this over here. Oh, we get a, as the colonel would put it, cheeky tunnel. Okay, well, we can, we can get behind that idea. Uh, okay. Good. So we have that. Now. Um... I'm not sure that was the right way to do that. Uh, you want the uh, track dealt on the other side. Um, yeah, I I kind of do. Um, so so we can avoid traffic jams, right? Uh, so we're going to bring this across here. Um, Okay, yeah, yeah, we'll do it that way. Yeah, I think that's better. Um, okay, so if we take, take that out. Right. Good. Now, while we're thinking about it, we're weighing a couple signals on this. Um, yeah, kind of like that. Good. Now, um, I think that's going to be it for this part. Um, I've got some editing work to do on it due to the crash to desktop, but, uh, yeah, it should be, should be generally okay. Why, why are you just parked there? Oh, you were just waiting. Okay. Uh, right. So that uh, that's that. Uh, next time, I'll put the station in and connect up this here uh, iron ore mine. And then, uh, uh, then I'm not quite exactly sure what I'm going to do uh, next. I'll probably fling some trains on to... Uh, uh, connect up with these uh, oil wells and it's a little bit of cash extra cash coming in and then uh, I'll move uh, I'll move this way to uh, uh, connect up uh, uh, stuff around uh, Killeen yeah uh, which will also be I think I'll put the the hub over here uh, attached to the fuel refinery, I think. Yeah, okay, so that's what I'm going to do. Uh, so that's uh, that's going to be all for this time. Uh, you know, next time, hopefully uh, less crashing and, uh, you know, more uh, constructing stuff. Anyway, uh, you know, that's all for now, so stay healthy. Don't let the zombie apocalypse take you out. And... Uh, yeah, uh, I'll be back uh, Thursday, I think it will be, with the uh, next part. So, see you then.